Hello everyone, my name is Durden77, bringing you more Dragon Ball Legends in your face. Keep talking about this game. Today, we are going to be doing some summons because I am very hype on some stuff that just happened. But real quick, I want to let you know, uh, there was a big update. Man, it seems like every update now is a big update. Um, like, this game has just been firing on all cylinders uh, constantly lately, but really just a lot of stuff was added um in content as well as balance things of that nature so first off this is what we're about to begin to is the dragon ball uh brawly collab summon two featuring super saiyan god vegeta which i'm super hype about we'll get back to that because that's what we're going to be doing in this video now this is so dope though so we had another balance re uh you know uh, rebalancing um and they have been so great about this uh these characters got rebalanced turles my dog i was just talking about him in a purple purple red video got rebalanced and he is fucking good now it's so awesome i've been playing with him already in pvp and he's just really really good fucking love it makes me so happy hercule um mr satan a uh, piccolo uh pan and krillin all five of these characters very good choices to get rebalanced of course you got your extreme units red krillin piccolo um green vegeta and um blue cell as well as android 16 no heroes because they just they i think they're just done caring about heroes besides shallot at this point but pretty much um yeah i might go over these more later uh in a video but these are some serious buffs all these characters you need to reconsider uh playing uh, especially i would say turles uh green piccolo and pan uh those three buffs seem to be the most potent and holy shit especially piccolo uh, whew, he, he, he is pretty much right back to where he was as, as being a huge problem and really when he at release in my opinion for a long time he was probably the best overall character in the game and they have done him justice with his buff so absolutely awesome <clears throat> there's also a banner that comes with that as well if you want to summon for any of those uh, older characters that's cool um, of course there's the balance changes there's more detail on the balance changes here on what's actually changed so look into that if you want to know about that uh, new PvP reset. Uh, now we'll be uh, farming Kaba this season, which honestly he's not that good of an EX, but it's still, I don't know, it's a new EX to farm. I always like doing that. Um, and hopefully he'll get a buff at some point where he can buff Universe 6. And this is really interesting as well. They renewed the bonus battle, so now you get adventures while doing it. Um, these adventures can provide super souls as well, which is really, really cool. Um, so if you need some super souls, that's a really good way to go about it. And they added um, an entirely new difficulty to Rising Battle Brawly. Um, the scream difficulty. Oh, by the way, I did manage to nab Chi Chi. I threw a couple more CCs. Didn't get Bulma, but I'll take Chi Chi. Um, so they added an entirely new difficulty scream. Oh gosh. So, um, yeah, yeah. I, I haven't even messed with this yet. I've been still, uh, finishing up other events like sell, um, still farming, you know, the candy stuff, stuff like that. Uh, but they also added more rising battles. So I think you can actually get him to six star yet. Once again, have not messed with this stuff yet, but uh, pretty awesome, uh, you know, it's it's Drew Barrymore would be done for when it comes to this difficulty um, And I, I think that's kind of awesome that they named it that um, Anyway, let's get into the real shit here. Um, this is what I've Man, so last night kind of out of nowhere They just dropped that Super Saiyan God Vegeta is going to be coming to the game now We have a new banner here uh, Dragon Ball Super Collab Summon Part 2 now that's also awesome because um, that pretty much, you know, everybody's been wondering for a very long time where the hell is Gogeta Blue? Um, you know, when, is he going to be coming at when the movie releases in US? Like, what, what's going to happen? But this pretty much confirms they're going to be doing multiple banners for this movie, and one of them's definitely got to be Gogeta Blue. Like, no question. It could even potentially be part three. Um, so keep that in mind. Also, really interesting thing to note Vegeta is the only new character on this banner, but it does include Brawly as well. Um, and Goku and these guys um, so pretty much if you have it seems as though if you have the patience like let's say part three is Gogeta if you have the patience which I don't you're probably going to get a banner a part three banner that has Gogeta Super Saiyan God Vegeta and Brawly and that's a hell of a banner so just something to consider if you're really trying to save some stones um, this banner kind of ranges from awesome to eh, depending on what characters you have so First off, of course, you got Super Saiyan God Vegeta. I'll actually show Super Attack really quick, considering we've only got one character to really go over in this video. I'll make it quick. Awesome Super Attack looks pretty much straight out of the movie. Uh, looks looks wonderful. His model and everything just looks good. Oh, it's so sick. Um, anyway, but he looks pretty dope. His stats are good. Uh, his stats are not anything crazy. It's critical, actually. Is that actually is pretty crazy? But 
his stats are, are not too nuts, um, but, you know, he does have a high strike attack and everything else is pretty in the middle. Blast defense is actually pretty weak. Um, but uh, what really ha you know, starts making him come together is his skills. Uh, he's got a super increase his strike damage. Um, he also is a melee type. Um, the green card reduces next damage sustained by 10%. I love these green cards. Like, Deborah's got one. I think Fat Boo's got one. I, I fucking love those cards. They're great. Um, it's pretty cheap. It does not increase as well, like, a characters like Deborah. I um, mean, it also gives him 15% strike damage. So, just a great green card all around. Main ability, 40% to strike damage inflicted for 25 counts, which is big. Uh, minus 5 to strike arts as well. So, he's going to be doing... 14 key um you know strike arts uh with a huge amount of damage behind them that is very scary z ability is for god key which i'm really excited because i do have um super saiyan god goku as well as beerus so i'm really hoping if i can nab this guy that i can start you know god key is starting to rise it, and eventually probably what's going to happen is it's going to explode when like the super saiyan blue um you know blues and, and gogeta and stuff like hit um but yeah I'm, I'm excited about that i think with three characters that will probably be enough to run a super saiyan god beerus and go uh godku uh team so we'll go from there now his unique abilities are great when the character enters the battlefield 50 percent to strike damage inflicted for 20 timer counts if his health ratio is higher than enemies uh, that's a huge buff it's, it's just a strike damage so it's not quite as good as someone like Majin vegeta's but of course Majin vegeta you have to deal with the debuff uh, but you combine that especially with his main ability and especially uh, and I'll, actually i'll go into that later i want to talk about how kaba could work with this guy um and then this awesome awesome ability um this is cross arm guard which is taken from the movie where he blocks brawly right when he attacks him uh reduces damage uh, received by 40 percent until combo ends with changing cover applies strike and blast armor when changing cover cover and if the enemy is at close range it will be knocked back to long range uh, plus five to substitution count so pretty much if your opponent comes at you with a strike card or a sidestep blast or they're close range and you switch into vegeta not only will he tank the hit for less damage but he will actually end the combo he just he just straight up stops it like by he blocks it with the armor and then he sends them back uh it's fantastic it could potentially be a huge game changer like you know uh characters like kale can break cards which is great but people still have access to the rising rush whereas with vegeta you can just stop it all together um which is which is really scary and impressive i think it could really alter the way a lot of people play especially when it comes to sidestep um so yeah i mean honestly for me uh, vegeta is my favorite dragon ball character always has been i love all of his forms so much but the super saiyan god form that finally premiered in the brawly movie is just so dope like it, it just looks so good on him i think it looks a, actually a good bit better on him than it does goku um not only that but i really want him for a lot of reasons number one you know uh for just to have him because he's just fucking dope um and number two because it's good for movie teams i want to mess with god key but also, I managed to nab myself two copies of Kaba the other day. Um, and I've really, really been having a lot, of fun, a lot of fun messing with him and making teams with him. I think that he's a great uh, support character. He's like a support blast hybrid. And I think he works very well on color counter teams, which I'm a big fan of. Um, so I, I really, really, really want to make a green, green, yellow team with him, green Vegeta, and yellow Super Saiyan God Vegeta. I think that would be devastating. Um, and I, I just... I, I feel like that right now there's not a good yellow Vegeta to work with that. There's Super Vegeta, but his strike is so weak, which Kaba buffs. Um, and there's not a good Universe 6 yellow. So this could really, if I get him, I can make a team I've been really wanting to, to make. Um, and number two, we've got Brawly. So this banner is already fantastic. If you don't have Brawly, you have the potential of summoning um, the new Super Saiyan God Vegeta, as well as one of, if not still the best character in the entire game. This this guy, this, this motherfucker right here just continues to be a problem. Um, I, I have him at four star. I'm one away from getting five. So while I'm not like super hunting for him, I would love to get at least one more. If I could get one more, I'd be very happy with that. So that's cool. Super Saiyan God Goku, another fantastic unit. Just a really, really crisp unit. Like he, he is... He's one of those units that you just put in a box and you tie him up with a perfect little bow, and he's just like, I, I can do most things you need me to do. I might not be the absolute best at them, but I'm, I'm going to do them really well. Um, he, he's a very good unit. The problem is, is he stalked me on the step-up banner that he was on, and I've already got him to five stars. So I really am not looking to get too many more of this guy. It's not going to help me a lot. Um, but if you don't have these three, then this is already an excellent banner for you because these are some of the best three units in the game. Um, 
and if you do have these you know these two then you know like i said now you're just just trying just for this guy which makes the banner a lot less valuable uh, and these are the two we'll call them burner units legendary super saiyan probably oh my god this guy in my opinion especially after the last round of buffs might be the worst unit in the game like this guy fucking sucks i honestly thought that he was overrated even at release where people were just like oh he's just the absolute best just rips or everything like I felt like Piccolo still countered him well enough, and it wasn't that big of a deal. Like he he was he was tough, yeah. But Jesus Christ, he has aged so poorly. Um, you know, pretty much everything about him is bad. His it, you know his stats aren't very good. His Z ability isn't even good on the Movie Saga team. There's better blues on Movie Saga because of Cooler. Um, you know, there's a, there's a fucking better Brawly in general. Like he's he's just really he does not offer much value to any team whatsoever right now it's, it's kind of a shame I, i'm not honestly a big fan of this brawly i never have been so i'm not too worried about it but i know a lot of people do like him so hopefully he'll get a buff but this is definitely going to be the worst card to pull on this banner for sure um and then pycon who is who is still a really solid unit um he, he especially after the last buff he's he's great he is one of the best all-around units in the game problem is it's just by now a lot of people have a ton of them i he is actually the sparking i have the closest to seven stars so really not looking to pull more of him he's not going to do much for me i um, mean honestly we just want new shit uh, that's it new shit so so i am pretty much just shooting for super saiyan god vegeta um it's kind of a long shot because yeah i mean i just explained why he, he's the only sparking on this banner i actually need uh i will take a brawly that will make me happy but all the others i'm really not going to be happy with at all um, so pretty much I, I got I got a good amount of stones. I got 6,000 stones. I'm going to go ahead and start here with the daily summon. I saved this for us here. Um, now if I pull Vegeta, I will probably stop. Um, because like I said, it's just not worth it to try to go for another Vegeta. Um, if I pull Vegeta, I, I will probably stop at that point. So, but if not, I'm going to probably keep going. So we're just getting, I'm just going to skip this to get this going. That's a daily. We got a Zarbon. Dope. All right, um, so let's go ahead and get into this shit here. Um, oh man, so we got 6,000 crystals, um, and pretty much we're just gonna go until we get Vegeta. That's that's the plan at least, unless I just start getting, uh, unless it just is bad, I don't know. We'll see, but let's go ahead and start this first multi off. Oh, and by the way, of course you got the 999Z power, which is one of the main reasons why I'm going for this so hard. Uh, let's do this, please, please Vegeta, please, please Vegeta. Give me some good animations. Girl banner did not go super well for me, so please, let's change that. I did download all, so I never worry about that. Destroyed Namek, but no pods? That's a that's an odd feeling. Um, so this is probably not going to have a sparking in it. Um, it will definitely have some EXs, or at least one, but that's weird. Okay, I saw no pods, and I was like, that's got to be General Tao, right? And no, no General Tao, so... Yeah, this is probably going to be garbage. I've got him to seven stars. Uh, if I could get more EX Khalifas, I would actually be really happy. I've been using her quite a bit lately. Um, she's very good, so, eh, raditz. But, but yeah, anything, I mean, only other EXs besides that I'd like would be, like, cooler, EX cooler. Um, I finally got Toa the other day, so there's not really too many EXs I want. Okay. So that's nothing. Fantastic way to start it off. Um, got my Z medals though. All right. Let's go ahead and jump into another summon here. Uh, see what we get. See if I I, I kind of have a bad feeling about this banner. I did even before going in. I feel like I might be overshooting a little bit. Jesus choice. Christ! Oh my God! Um, <laughs> yeah. I I kind of feel like I'm I'm just probably gonna go a little bit too hard for this guy and and just maybe not kid him. But damn yeah this is this is looking really bad one pie okay I, was, I didn't know if he might even lose so yeah this is gonna be maybe even all heroes um this is looking looking pretty bad two multis in pretty bad uh so let's see some, uh, hero hero man oh my god if i am on the if i I'm getting robbed right now or if I'm on the edge of a building about to fall I'm in good shape because I got heroes for days Whew, that's bad just seeing those all blue is, is just that's that's never good all right gonna keep going uh, let's do another one here oh Jesus Christ this is I, I can kind of feel it 
it's not feeling good. And like I said, I kind of already had this feeling before this banner, but I just love Vegeta so much. If it wasn't for him, I would be chilling, but I can't. I got no chill for Vegeta. I never have. I never will. Um, what we got here? Okay, five pods, Namek. That's more like it, but no Super Saiyan. I, man, five pods does not do anything for me if I don't get Super Saiyan. Like, a lot of times I check out that point. Um, red text, no Super Saiyan. I have a feeling this is probably not going to be another sparking. I think it's, yeah, it's going to clash in the middle and no Super Saiyan 3. So we got EX, Pan, uh, Raccoon, Thouser, which I am pretty low on anyway. Oof, jeez, man. No, Vegeta. Vegeta's trying to screw me, man. He's trying to take all my CC. I know it. I know it. I knew it. I knew he was going to do this to me. Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> not a, so three multis in, not a single sparking. Um, damn. Yeah, that's pretty bad. This is about as bad as my girl's banner luck. Um, at least eventually that did come to pass. But all right, so we got three left. I'm, I'm going to keep going. That's the plan. So let's do this. Another consecutive summon. Oh man, this is bad. I need to save this. Biopods destroyed Namek. I'm I'm due for his barking at this point. Come on, please. Oh my god. So this is looking uh Okay, we got a Super Saiyan on the pull at least, but I still don't feel like this is gonna be it. We're gonna shoot it. We're gonna clash and it's gonna be nothing. It's gonna be nothing. It's going to be nothing. Wow! Damn, that gonna be four multis that we got here with, with nothing, no sparking whatsoever. Okay, I'll take that. Um, I, I've only got one of him, so I will definitely take that. Um, Jesus Christ, man. I, what, I, I, I'm getting this Vegeta a lot. Can you just, can you dye your hair red for me? That'd be really cool. Um, you know, we could go to the salon, get that done. Oh man, man, oh man, oh man, oh man. Holy shit. Yeah. So, I mean, that's the best thing I've gotten so far after 4,000 crystals is a limit break for 17. Um, so, that's not good. <laughs> that's, not, that's not good at all. Oh shit, we got two more. Now I'm going to be down to a peasant 66 CC. So we will see what happens here. Oh my god. So somebody help me out there, please. Uh, I don't know. Just hold your hands up. Give me some. I'm not seeing a spirit bomb around me, so I don't think anybody's got their hands up. I don't know. Oh shit. All right, let's do this again. You can't go five multis without sparking, right? You can't go five multis without sparking, right? Oh, you can. You can. Holy shit. Wow. Okay. Um, this is exceptionally bad. <laughs> this is probably the worst summon streak I've had ever. And little tech. So yeah, this is this is fucked. This is nothing. This is more garbage. It's gonna be in the middle and come on. Wow. Okay. So him. I don't see him too often. Whatever. I'll take him. Another extreme. I can use him. Sure. Sure. Man. Wow, this is uh, this is brutal. Holy shit! Oh my god, how many times am I gonna get that Vegeta? Holy shit! Oh 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 shit. That was the first fake out I've gotten in a very long time. I mean, only thing I can say is at least it's not Brawly. At least it's not Brawly. First sparking, a yeah, old Brawly at least, of course. First sparking is just, just man, a Pycon, a Pycon. Pycon also just has this stigma to where it's like, even though he is good these days, he's still Pycon, so like when you summon, you just don't want to get Pycon. Oh my God, all right. So this is the last one. Um, and if I don't get him, then I, I don't know. I, I don't know if I'm going to come back to this. I probably am not, I, you know, but I'll probably just stick with dailies at that point. But, man, all right. So, cool. We'll see what we got here. Fuck. Please, please don't just leave me with 66 crystals and nothing but a pike on. I have, I, I have a feeling that's what's going to happen. But let's see. Fuck. Fuck. No. I'm going to take you down. Okay, so three pods. Oh man, this is gonna be bad. Yeah, it's gonna be bad. Taking the trade. Um, little letters. 
Yep. This is gonna be another ship kill. Wow. Okay. So that was six K CC with one sparking pike. That is uh that's pretty pretty acceptable. Okay, I'll take that. Sure. I will take that. That's uh Yeah. Don't have her yet. Oh my god. Wow, I haven't gotten beat down by this game this hard in a long time. This is this is pretty brutal. Holy shit. Oh, I don't need him at all. Alright. Well, that is it. That was probably the uh yeah, the worst summons I've ever had in this game. I don't think I've ever gone well, no. There's been some banners that have been pretty bad to me. The Gogeta Lezing, or Legends Rising banner was pretty awful to me. I still don't have Gogeta or Janemba, um, as well as Super Vegeta's original banner. Uh, it was really bad to me. Vegeta's in general, for some reason, have are, are very tough for me to get, of course, because he's my favorite character. They probably know that. But anyway, um, man, yeah, absolutely nothing there. Super depressing, sad times. Um, I'm... I'm probably going to just leave this alone. I'm going to see if I can farm up some more crystals. Maybe try to go for another one before the 999 is gone. But, ouch. That is, um, that <laughs> hurts very bad. So, anyway, like I said, if you don't have either of those three characters, one of the best banners around, if you have a certain amount of characters, um, you know, maybe not one of the best to spend your CC on. But just be careful out there. Um, Jesus. And... I'm going to go, uh, I don't know, I'm going to go die somewhere. Uh, maybe you'll see me again, maybe you don't, because I died. Bye.